Thank you so much, Sir Adnan, for giving me an opportunity, an opportunity to choose a topic that is very, very, very interesting to be honest. So the reason of choosing two fish algorithm is that uh, one of that, like you were focused, like you were more uh, since like you were advising me to take that topic. And secondly, uh, like I was like a little bit confused between like, like what is the best? The blue fish is the best or two fishes and best. So while choosing, so I have read read about a lot of things about two fish. So uh, so before moving further, uh, I will let you know that uh, I have covered the, all the questions in this presentation. So you don't need to uh, add any question. You don't 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 need to uh, ask any question. Uh, so I guess I have covered all the questions within uh, this presentation. So let's move further. Well, my name is Mithu Khan. I already have talked to you about. So uh, moving further, like two fish. Two fish algorithm is designed and it was implemented by Bushnar. And uh, uh, let me let's tell you about Bushnar. He's a like great great crypto analyst, and he has a lot of books, and he has written a lot of books about it. So uh, I was talking, I was seeing different sort of blogs about Bushnar. So I, I, I don't have an idea before uh, about uh, who is Bushnar, but when I have just searched about in YouTube and different sort of blog, so he is very famous to be honest. So let's move to the another slide that is history. So what about two fish? Like two fish was published in 1988, drive from blue fish and like before two fish, there's a blue fish. So <laughs> like it's very two fish, like sound very much interesting name. And uh, like uh, in like if you just translate and do is something very much funny. Do much liya. Okay. So I uh, like bluefish. What is bluefish? Like bluefish, uh, we have limitation in bluefish. Although it's very much fast as compared to uh, as compared to fish, but it has some complexity and has a uh, like limitation. So we are stick on 64 bit in bluefish, but in uh, in two fish we have like. Uh, like wide range of block size, like we can do 128, 256, 192 bits. So there's no limitation. And the structure is facial network. I will just let you know about the facial network. And round is 16, like you have 16 round to complete within it. So it's it sound very like crazy and it's it sound very much complex by the way, but it's easy to understand. Okay, so uh, like uh, uh, what about the round, like what is why two fish not blue fish? My question is that like normally when I was reading it, so I was asking myself a question that why blue fish, why not two fish? So the blue fish encryption algorithm operate on 64 bit block of plain text, while two fish uses key length of 128 bit, 192 bit, or 256 bit. You know that there's no limitation to be honest at when you are using two fish. And bluefish is a symmetric block cipher that can be used to drop and replace on dash and es. So we have already uh, learned about what like about dash and es, es, and this is like uh, Sir Adnan has just uh, in the previous class has described about the, what is dash and what is es. So it will help a lot in understanding uh, about the bluefish. And uh, you know that uh, when you have limitations, so you cannot like play like in the algorithm like uh, in deep in a deeper sense. So. Uh, because we have this, uh, uh, because in the previous slide we have uh, talked about what is facial network. So the structure of this algorithm is facial network, to be honest. So what is facial network? Facial network is, is a cryptographic technique used in construction of block server based algorithm mechanism. And was designed by IBM employee and uh, whose name is Hall Facial. And uh, with his name it was implemented. And it's the first use of facial network was Lucifer block cipher. It's a very famous, to be honest, block cipher. And we have a lot of things about that Lucifer. Our facial network is also known as facial cipher. So if we call it cipher as well, facial cipher. So facial cipher is a technique used to construction of block cipher. Like we, when we are implementing the structure, so we use a technique that is called facial net, uh, 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 like facial network, and uh, and we implement two bits. We construct the block cipher based algorithm and mechanism. Okay. 
I guess you uh, are able to understand what I'm trying to say. Okay. Now, two fish. Two fish is a symmetric key block server. Now my question for myself is, what is symmetric key? And because I don't know symmetric key, what is symmetric key? And uh, when I just search it, is symmetry according to symmetry key? Our algorithm for cryptography that uses some algorithm keys, same like you can say same algorithm keys for both encryption of plain text and decryption. So we it, it uses an identical key, like identical algorithm keys for for encryption of plain text and decryption of cipher text as well. Okay. Okay. What is blob now? Now another question is that. You are talking about block server, block server, block server. What is block server, man? What is block server? A block server is a basic a computer computer routine that takes any amount of plain plain text and convert into code text or cipher text, like something that is unreadable. Like it's something that is something designed. We have a structure. We have some like planning or some sort of code that we have generated, and uh, it's not readable. And only the person who has just made the code is uh, can read and they can just convert it or can just read uh, and can convert the plain text into uh, into a, a cipher text. Like well, for example, if you have a plain text for ABC and you have to design an algorithm that is DCE and you don't know because your code was ABC ABC and you are not able to understand that because I was just put it ABC. So the person who has just decrypted it only knows that. What uh, like how? What is the description of it? And the person who have just implemented plain text knows the actually the key. What is key? So it's it's a vice versa, and it's something that you design a code, and most probably, most probably, uh, up say like it's identical. More blocks of it that use a routine based keys that you convert uh, the code text into cipher text. Okay, so it's a very easy. Okay, you can see it's a key cipher text key plain text or plain text key. Cipher text and key, and it's a key, and it's about a key in a plain text and a key in a in a in a cipher text. Okay, now you, I guess you are able to understand the definition of block cipher. Okay, so and uh, like what happened, we have to understand what is two fish uh, algorithm, who created it, develop it, and what a block size, what are what is the structure of this algorithm is, and how many rounds we can cover in two fish sixteen rounds. Okay, now move it to uh, and what is two phase is symmetrical key block cipher and what is symmetric key and what is block cipher is now, now, now it's a very interesting thing that's algo. So uh, I guess you are able to see my uh, like it's an algo and how it's designed. It's it's look very complicated to be honest. When I first started to understand it, uh, I was not able to totally understand what exactly the two phase algorithm is. So uh, although I have just read it uh, a lot about it, the two phase algorithm. How it operates and how it generally works, and it's it's something that is uh, how it's unique. Uh, because uh, when you because normally uh, when you talk about algorithms, they are unique with each other, and because most probably no no uh, such algorithm is uh, in this world has created uh, are same. Uh, so, so two fish. This is a distinct uh, distinct feature to be honest. And are uh, are used for a P computer key. Like you can they you can see over here there's a plain text. Uh, let me highlight it first. Like it's a plain text over here, and you can see over here 